Horror fans ran for their lives tonight from the historic Colonial Theater for Blobfest. The reenactment of the iconic scene from the 1958 film draws crowds to Phoenixville every year. It's part of a three-day festival. And here's CBS Philadelphia's Siafa Lewis. In downtown Phoenixville, no summer is complete, at least not in the last quarter century, without Blobfest. What you just saw is just part of the reason why. It's all about celebrating the Colonial Theater's role in the 1958 movie, The Blob. And as you can see, there's a lot of local pride. This weekend marks the 25th anniversary of the annual celebration, and it draws revelers from all over, and of course, of all ages, to take in the fun and the excitement. So tell us why you're here tonight. Uh, because I've never been here, and I want to experience the Blob Fest with my family, and I will and I haven't watched a lot of the Blob movies, but I like how the scenes I saw. The energy. I really need to see the energy of people running out. I did it last year and I loved it, but this little guy, I want him to experience the run as well. And to be one of the lucky few who gets to run out of the Colonial Theater as though their life is at stake, appears to be an immense thrill. The Blob has been one of my favorite movies since I was a kid. and. When I discovered Blobfest several years ago, I had to be part of it. <laughs> it's great! Oh, it's fun. It, it, how much fun can you have running out of a movie theater screaming like fools and reenacting a, a great movie? That's perfect. And did I mention Friday is just the first night of this year's Blob Fest? Tomorrow we're playing the Blob all day in English and in Spanish. Yes, and then um, Sunday we have people from Mystery Science Theater 3000 who are going to be riffing on 1972 Beware the Blob. And uh, actually tomorrow night, Saturday, we're doing a second run out. So if anyone missed it tonight, they can come witness it tomorrow. In Phoenixville, Siafa Lewis, CBS News, Philadelphia.